A Chelsea mother now facing charges in the death of her three-year-old son. WBZ's Tammy Mutasa joins us live in Chelsea tonight with what we're learning. Tammy. Yeah, Courtney, well, this one really hurts for neighbors because this is a child and they used to see that little boy all the time. That's why the community has started this memorial for him behind me. And now his mom is charged in his death and the community wants to know what went wrong here. A loving little soul honored with the memorial of balloons and a teddy bear outside his home. But it was inside where the DA says three-year-old Yael Guardado Prudencio was found dead in his mom's apartment Sunday morning. Now 25-year-old Jennifer Prudencio has been charged with involuntary manslaughter and reckless endangerment of a child. Very sad to see a little kid just die and you know, CNN a couple of days ago. That's all you can do. Just pray to God and continue. The large presence of first responders and frantic yelling is what concerned neighbors. The lady friend, she was crying downstairs here with the other girl, the other daughter she have. And I asked her what happened and she, they told me that um, the kid was dead in bed. Soon, the incomprehensible word went around that the little toddler, who was the youngest of three siblings, had died. Raymond knew the family for four years. She was handling three kids by herself, and I think it was really, you know, a little tough for her, you know, I mean, a single mother with three kids, you know. Detectives haven't said how the toddler died or the moments leading up to his death, but neighbors are left wondering how the young mom ended up facing criminal charges. It's very hard for her, but I mean for her because that's her little kid. But as, a, as an adult, we have to take responsibilities. And back out here live again, you can see that memorial for a little Yael that the community has started. His mom is expected to be in Chelsea District Court tomorrow for arraignment. And that is where we're expecting to learn many more details about what happened inside that apartment. For now, live in Chelsea, Tammy Matassa, WBZ News.